Hey guys, Dr. Jamie Richards here. I'm back again, the Underground Fit Club. We're talking about pro tips for fat loss. We've done the first four pro tips. Today's the last pro tip, and I left one of my favorite ones for last. It really is a key component here at the Underground Fit Club. Anybody who's trained in the Move by Design training system understands that this is vital. And you know, maybe you've already been involved in a strength training program, and that's great. That is really the key, and I know that there's a lot of other types of programs which are great, and they can have some really good benefits. So I don't wanna knock those programs, but if a program is very much based in conditioning, you know, running around, jumping up and down, doing burpees, which is great, and those things are really wonderful, but there's a lot of reasons why those will peter out over time, and I don't see those as the most sustainable approach to fat loss, and then really creating a healthy lifestyle. You have to have a strength training program, and you know, we call it a strength and conditioning program because there is conditioning built into it, but a large part of your fat loss is stimulated through developing strength. Why? Because one of the byproducts of strength is creating lean muscle. And no, I'm not talking about, you know, big bulky biceps, you know, a lot of females are concerned about that. You don't need to be concerned about that. That's not something that's going to happen for you, but you do need to have a strength training program. And I can't really put enough focus on this. It's such a huge piece of the puzzle. The more strength you develop, the greater chance you're going to develop lean muscle mass. As you develop lean muscle mass, your body has the ability to really, number one, we went back to carbohydrates from the last video. The more lean muscle you have, the more carbohydrate you can take in. There's more storage areas to place that other than turning it into body fat or adipose tissue. The other part is that your metabolism goes up. So as your lean muscle increases, your body needs more energy to sustain that muscle development. And as the energy requirements go up, guess what? The energy usage goes up by your body. So not only does it look better to develop lean muscle mass, but it also plays a huge role in fat loss, not just in the short term. We talked about this all the way back in pro tip number one, that fat loss is not a lifestyle, that it goes in phases. So creating lean muscle can play a big role in that fat loss phase. It can also help you create a very easy approach to sustainability over your lifetime. And I think that's one of the big keys is being able to sustain this as a lifestyle and not have to be stuck in this approach where you feel like you're trying to lose body fat all the time and you're, you know, hardcore dieting all the time to get the results. So there is an approach to do this. We've got it figured out at the Life by Design Center and the Fit Club. Check it out in the 12 and 28 program. And if you have any questions, post them below. And I really do hope to see you there. Make it a great day.